Okay, so in this example, we are asked to write this equation in center radius form. So it's got to look like this at the very end. The problem is it looks nowhere near close to that right now. And what we're going to do is we're going to get this in a way that we can try to complete the square. And that's exactly what we're going to do. So we're going to take the x square equation, and then we're going to take the y square equation, and we're going to complete the square. So I'm going to rewrite this just a little bit, and then um, we're, going to, we're going to complete the square to come up with this form. So I have another video on uh, completing the square, and I'll try to remember to put the description or the link to the completing the square video in the description at the bottom. So let's see here. Let's rewrite it a little bit. x squared minus 4x. I'm going to put plus parentheses square plus y square minus 18y plus parentheses square. I'm going to set it equal to, now this 49, I'm moving to the other side of the equal sign. So I'm going to put minus 49 there. Now remember that I added the parentheses squared right here. So let's go ahead and put it twice, okay? Once each time for each of these here right there. Okay, so what we're going to do in this spot is we're going to put half of this B coefficient and half of this B coefficient there. So I'm going to put negative 4 over 2 here, and here I'm going to put negative 18 over 2 there. And I'm going to do the same thing over here and over here. All right, perfect. So now let me just bring this down, and I'm going to have x squared minus 4x plus, and in this case, negative 4 over 2 is negative 2 square, plus y square minus 18y, plus, and in this case, a negative 9 square. And over here, we're going to have negative 49 plus negative 2 square, plus a negative 9 square. Now, here's the completing the square part. So we're going to bring this together and call this x minus 2 quantity square, Okay, like I said, if this is not making any sense, you're going to need to watch my video on completing the square. And I'll try to remember to put that link for you. And then down here, y minus 9 quantity square equals, and in this case, we have negative 49 plus 4 plus 81. Okay, so we have negative 49 plus 4 plus 81. So I think after completing the square, that part is probably the hardest part. So let's see what we get. So we have x minus 2 quantity square plus y minus 9 quantity square equals, and this right here, the sum of this, negative 49 plus 4 plus 81, is exactly 36. So this is the equation of the circle. All right, now let's see what we know about this circle. Well, this is the circle with a center at 2, 9. Okay, so this is our h and our k. And our radius for this circle happens to be 6 because that's the square root of the 36 there. So this is what we would do to complete the square for this. And it's actually a really nice problem. And it's not too bad, provided, again, that you remember how to complete the square.